What's up, Bank Squad? Tony Banks here, back at it again with another video. Hopefully, everybody is having a great day today. Today's gameplay, I want to talk a little bit about the map that you guys are seeing on screen right now. In this game, Modern Warfare 2019 is known as, I believe, Tasselik. I have to believe that's how you pronounce it. Tasselik or Tasselik Backlot. We've also seen this map two other times in Call of Duty's lifespan. We saw it in COD 4, and then we also saw it in COD 4 Remastered. And I kind of want to go over it just to, you know, just talk to you guys about how much I like it. You know, how much it changed. Do I enjoy how it is now? Do I enjoy Backlot the way it was before? So that's basically what today's video is going to be about. And it took me a while to get this gameplay. Honestly, guys, I'm not going to lie to you. It took me a while to get it. Mostly because if you're playing the map pack playlist, every single map, so uh, Sawmill and then also uh, Anaya Incursion, I, I believe that's how you pronounce it. I know in other videos I was pronouncing it wrong. Um, those two came up way more than this map came up. And every time this map came up, I ended up doing bad. But for the most part, uh, when playing on this map, I don't really have that feeling of, you know, that nostalgia feeling. Yeah, it's awesome. I, I really, really enjoy this map, but it doesn't bring back those nostalgia feelings when it comes to some of the other maps that I play. Uh, you know, for example, Crash. When we when I play Crash, Crash is one of my favorite maps in Call of Duty history. So when I'm playing Crash, I... I it, it, I have these little flashbacks in my head to playing Crash in COD 4 and playing Crash in MW2. And it's absolutely amazing. And the same thing with Vacant. Vacant is another one that's one of my top maps that I absolutely love and adore. It goes back to that. It's, it's the nostalgic feeling of playing it and, it. and you have those little flashbacks to when you were, you know, younger playing call of duty on those days where you can just play all day didn't have to worry about bills adulthood anything like that but you know hopefully we can go to back to back to those days someday someday i will be able to not necessarily go all the way back to you know not having any worries but to where i can just play call of duty all day and not really have too many doubts or too many worries but back to the game uh i'm glad that they brought this back I'm liking how they're setting up these new maps, you know, with each one, or not even new, excuse me, remakes. With each one of these, they have been doing them a little bit different because Modern Warfare likes to add on to the maps that have already been here. Like in this one, uh, that, this little back area with the vans, that was never there in the original map. Uh, there's like a few other areas in this game or in this map uh, that it wasn't there in the, in the original game. And I'm actually liking the new additions when it comes to this map. Um, you know, nonetheless, I still enjoy playing on this map, but like I said, it doesn't bring me back, to, you know, to how it used to be. Map flow and everything, for the most part, is good. I just feel like lately, while playing this map, I feel like, or just in general, when a playlist comes out that is like this, when it is geared towards, you know, new content, I feel like a lot of sweaty people are playing, and that's kind of like how it was. So, you know, it took me some time to actually get a good gameplay for you guys, but when I did, you know, have a good slash decent one, you know, everything was feeling good. It wasn't really getting irritated. The map felt good, and I, I, I enjoy it, you know? I enjoy it, and I hope Modern Warfare does decide to bring back old maps, uh, more old maps, I should say, because I'd rather have an old map that I know for sure is good that is going to work than to have a new random map that absolutely sucks. The flow is bad. You know, things aren't really too great. If you guys... Um you guys missed it i have a video uh it's probably a couple uploads ago a few uploads ago talking about my favorite map which is uh sawmill if you guys don't know about that that one will be uh in the description below and then i'll try to throw a card up on the screen as well so you guys can check that out um it, it just one of those maps is kind of it's kind of rare like you don't really know if a new map is going to be as good as a throwback map like I said, with the throwback map, you've played it once, you've played it twice, you know, you know, it, it's been on multiple Call of Duties and you know it's going to work. So when it comes to that, I really don't mind them doing that. Like I said, 
rather have that 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 crutch you know that little clutch to, to to fall back on knowing that everything is going to go right but playing this game or playing this map uh the different modes that i've played have been pretty much good i played hardpoint which is i believe what you guys are watching right now i have played headquarters on this map i have played kill confirmed i have played team deathmatch i haven't played free for all yet i do want to try out free for all on this but um it's it when it comes into like if you're going on quick play and searching you know regular games i haven't been able to get a free for all match on this map but nonetheless i think it will still go good free for all on modern fair really isn't the best because the lobbies don't really fill up the games are a lot slower but when it does come to some of the other game modes like i mentioned earlier um they're good i enjoy them uh, flow is good everything is good when it comes to kill streaks this is a map that it's good for all kill streaks personally uh, and that's a big thing that i look for in maps is that um flow is good you know all types of players can play in this one whether you are somebody who uh, is a camper you're somebody who likes to lock down an area or you are somebody who likes to rush around you are able to do that um, you know, whichever games or uh, game style or I should say play style you want to do, you are able to do that in this map. Streaks, you're able to use pretty much anything and everything and still do good. There are a couple of buildings and uh, not really a couple, there's more than a couple. There are a few, uh, a lot honestly, of areas that you can hide in to be able to, you know, not run into any, uh, you know, streaks. So like if someone calls in a chopper gunner or somebody calls in a veto, there's a lot of areas that you can uh, go in and hide in. But what I like about this map is it's a lot of openness. If you guys understand what I'm talking about when it comes to areas that you can shoot in. So with the veto can kind of get like a little, like a little clutch or a little, um, I don't even know the word that I'm looking for. It's on the tip of my tongue, but I can't, I can't think of the word, but you can get like a little angle. That's what it is. You can get a little angle and your veto can get in there. Uh, same thing when it comes to you know getting a chopper gunner those little angles like especially right here on construction this building yes you can hide in it but the building is so opened up that you are able to shoot in still you know from other areas so overall uh this map honestly guys um i don't want to go too high because it's not one of my favorite ones it still runs good but if i had to give uh, a rating for this map it would be a 6.5 or a 7 out of 10 uh, when it comes to everything, you know, the likeness, uh, my, uh, you know, me enjoying it, how the flow is, how streaks are, how it is when it comes to other players. Overall, 6.5 dash 7 out of 10 is what I'm going to rate this map. Now, um, like I said, love to see other throwbacks, whether it's from Modern Warfare, or excuse me, whether it's from COD 4, uh, Modern Warfare 2, Modern Warfare 3. As you guys know, uh, we are getting hard hat a little bit later in the season three lifespan. So I cannot wait until that one comes out. When that one does come out, obviously you guys already know I'm going to make a video on it, just like the one I made for this map and the, also the other two maps. Uh, when it comes to the new maps, that's what I'll do. I kind of want to give like a, a little rating, let you know exactly how I feel about it rate it out when it comes to play styles streaks uh, just different things like that so hopefully you guys enjoyed today's gameplay there is a little bit more time left on today's gameplay but i am going to end up ending the commentary right here so if you guys did enjoy today's video you guys already know what to do make sure to smash that thumbs up button also if you're new to my channel make sure to hit the subscribe button and while you are there make sure to press the bell button right next to the subscribe button to be notified every single time i do upload a new video i'm tony banks and i'll see you wonderful subscribers in the next one peace out Thank you.